The much talked about and controversial straight pride parade marched through the streets of Boston today. The parade was in response to gay pride events. A few hundred marchers took part. They were far outnumbered, though, by counter protesters who lined the route from Copley Square to City Hall Plaza. WBC's Paul Verton reports there were heightened emotions between the two groups. Welcome to the first annual Boston Straight Pride Parade. Waving American flags and dressed in all types of costumes, more than 100 people took part in the straight pride parade in Boston. USA! USA! The participants, USA. most of them Trump supporters, marched from Copley Square to City Hall, voicing their strong views on traditional American values. And our beliefs are that God made one man and one woman, and they get together and procreate. I can't sit down in my house no more and be quiet that I need to stand up for my godly values. The parade was met with even louder protesters from the LGBTQ community and Antifa. Police with riot gear on bikes and in armored cars were out in full force. Along the parade route, several protesters were arrested. The rally part of this event has been delayed because organizers say some of the special guests who were scheduled to speak have not been able to get through the security checkpoints, which makes these protesters happy. We can't hear you. The point of being here today is to make sure that they know that they're not welcome in Boston. A lot of people call them white supremacists and, and Nazis and things like that, which is, I don't, I don't know if that's, I mean, that's, that's far from the truth in my mind. There's, you know, there's, of course, ridiculousness on both sides. Um, and it's just the matter who's louder. Police say no major injuries were reported. More than a dozen people were arrested. In Boston, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.